This is Phnom Penh, the capital city of Cambodia. Located in the heart of Southeast Asia, Cambodia is a small country compared with others in the region. But integration into the ASEAN economic community has brought Cambodia into contact with ASEAN's more than 600 million citizens, making it a key destination for future global investment. For the past two decades, peace and political stability have fueled the rapid growth of Cambodia's garment, services, and construction sectors. And of course, the banking sector is the backbone of this growth. Cambodia is a growing country, and we feel the power of you know, growing everywhere. So looking at the outside, you can see lots of you know, buildings. It's brand new. So uh, that is uh, uh, you know, um, proof of the uh, growth of economy. Cambodia's GDP was $16.7 billion in 2014, up 7.1 percent over the previous year. And with young people making up 68 percent of the population, the kingdom's economic boom is poised to continue. But in order for companies to invest in Cambodia, they have to feel confident about the security of their data. Of course, uh, uh, we have lots of you know, um, business in, uh, all over the world. And uh, uh, security you know, uh, is a very important part of our business. And uh, not only technology, but also you know, um, keeping a, a server or keeping a, a information. Uh, would be very, very you know, different thing from the banking operation. However, our business consists of you know, information. That's why um, um, NTT uh, must be uh, our partner. NTT Communications Cambodia opened its Phnom Penh office in 2010. Country manager Marit Kin sees great potential for Cambodia's future growth. If we come back to before 2010s, uh, we go back to 2013 until 2018. So Cambodian is like uh, more uh, popular and it is growing for the uh, property business. You see the, the property is coming up you know, 10 times, 20 times based on the areas. So after that, uh, in 2010, um, uh, Japanese government have uh, attract, I mean, eyes on the uh, uh, a Cambodian, I mean Southeast Asia, and they, they see Cambodians one of potential. So uh, at that time, you know, our company have uh, uh, decided that we should have a branch in Cambodia. Toyota has a history in Cambodia that stretches back 23 years. Today, Toyota Cambodia Co. Limited relies on NTT Communications for all of their ICT needs. Vì mô mình có một mô nó dùng có tụ của phần nó mới mà chuối operate nó lơ business dưng nó chứ cất lơ con phía. Ba con phía hay năng ca support lỡ cứ dưng chưa chẹ tại mà đó cứ dưng vô. Mình này tha dưng chưa chẹ dưng ở thơ ở ở phách cho mô năng operation và dưng xong cắt một chút năm. Và dưng tụ tại phnai mô này เอ่อเสวาระบบอินทรัพย์อันดีทีเด้แต่เครื่องกดมาฉน้ํานั้นคือคนเพียวกดหรอกดซัพพอร์ตหรอจึงខ្ញុំក៏ផ្ដូរព
uh, the gallery in Cambodia. And we are growing more than 70% recent year. Um, expect to be another more four or five years. It's going to be the same, the same pace. And uh, uh, this message from MTT, uh, uh, we would like to invite and you know um, uh, ask a more investor to uh, to invest in Cambodia more. And we are the one who uh, support the uh, infrastructure, ICT infrastructure. I believe that they are going to be uh, feel uh, satisfied and feel uh, comfortable to do more business in Cambodia. For investors, there's no need to worry about ICT support in Cambodia because Cambodia has NTT Communications offering world-class quality support for ICT solutions.